Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel Tech and Tips with King. In this video, I'm going to show how you can run Windows 10 LTSB in your Android with using Limbo PC Emulator. So let's get into the video. In this video, I'm going to show how you can run Windows 10 LTSB in your Android with using Limbo PC Emulator application. So uh there are a lot of lot of videos on my youtube channel that i've shown how you can run windows the different different version of the windows like windows vista windows xp windows 7 windows 8 windows 8.1 windows 10 and windows 11 and the different different versions of the windows like uh, windows ltsb now i'm showing in this video the windows with the supported of the internet if uh, windows 10 the upcoming video on the windows 10 is will be the how you can access internal storage in the windows 10 so there are the different different versions of the windows 10 i have uploaded on my youtube channel so this is the another version ltsb so as i mentioned earlier there are a lot of windows versions so or uh, i have uploaded on my youtube channel so this is the another version windows ltsb so basically windows ltsb is the long term supportive windows 10 so basically this is the windows 10 only but uh, we mentioned the ltsb were because the long long term in the short form so in this video i'm going to show how you can run in your android and it's perfectly going to work so before if you want to run windows 10 ltsb in your android so you need application called limbo pc emulator you directly can't run so you need an application so basically this is the emulator so let me just give you a quick brief of the limbo pc emulator application so limbo pc emulator application basically a uh, emulator for android which while using uh, this application we can run any type of os which is supported by the pc only portable computer like uh, the windows linux i have run many many os's uh, in android with using limbo pc emulator application you can check out my previous videos there are tons of videos available on my youtube channel that i have shown how you can run os different different os like linux uh, kali linux ubuntu anonymous os windows mac os i've shown a lot of os have uh, run in android and this is the another topic video with the windows 10 so while using this application you can run any type of os in your android so this is the limbo pc emulator x86 version uh, if you want to run any type of os you can use this limbo pc emulator application there are a lot of videos on my youtube channel available so to run windows 10 you have to download this application the downloading in the description and second thing you have to download the windows 10 ltsb file so basically this is the 64 bit and it is in the vhd file and it will be approx 5 gbs so make sure you have enough storage in your android phone and enough data to download this it will be approx uh, 1.5 gb at first after extracting you will get the 5 gb file as you can see this is the file and the downloading in the description after downloading make sure it will be in the internal storage not in any folder so i kept in, in the internal for storage as you can see this is the windows 10 ltsb version 64 bit vhd so now let's get into the topic uh, how you can run windows 10 in your android so first of all you have to open the limbo pc emulator application so this video is only for a brief quick uh, overview of the windows 10 if you want internet or if you want to access internal storage let me know in the comments i make a separate video on how you can get that also so in this video i'm just going to give a quick brief of this windows 10 so let me just show you how you could do that so let me just show you how you can do that so you have to open the limbo pc emulator application at first it will look like this so let me just uh, again if you are new to this video i will give you the quick brief of this limbo pc emulator application and if you know about this you can get to the further so now this is the application it's very very, very easy interface easy to understand so that's why i'm making videos on the limbo pc emulator i'm not using another uh, other emulators because the limbo is very very easy to use and very uh, understandable interface so you get you can even can use that application not for the developers for everyone who want to get the experience of the windows who don't have pc and but want to use windows in android they can uh, do that so many people comment on my videos that it's only for show you did you can't do anything you can check out my previous video in the windows i have access internet i have browse and i have downloaded and i have also uh installed software and i've used them so i have done a lot of things with that so i can surely say that the windows is perfectly working with this emulator application and you can make your android phone into pc while using this emulator application so i really thanks to the developers of the application and the developers of the windows for providing so as you can see i'm going just to review uh, 
so now you have to open you have to click on the none you have to click on the new now you have to create the machine name windows so i'm giving this windows 10 you have to click on the custom and make sure you are using the official version of the limbo pc emulator application now you have to get into the board but you have to skip the end user interface if you are watching this video for very first time i'm just telling you skip the user interface section and you have to get into the board you have to select on the cpu model uh, as i mentioned earlier we are using the 64 bit uh, uh, windows 10 so make sure you are selecting the sandy bridge sandy bridge is a 64 bit processor and there are a lot of processor you can use like uh, code to duo code duo and many other versions like as you can see ivy bridge so there are a lot of uh, cpu options available but i am going to select sandy bridge because it's working perfectly for my android phone and the windows 10 also you can change according to you but make sure for this windows 10 you are selecting only 64 bit version only because that windows is 64 bit if you select 32 bit version it will not going to work they will give you the notification in the commands that uh, the processor is 32 bit this is the 64 bit os not going to work so make sure you are selecting the 64 uh, bit processor only now you have to get into the cpu cores you have to select the cores 4 and ram will depend on your smartphone specifications i'm going to select about 15 not i'm going to select about 2 gb of ram so it will depend on smartphone specifications you can select more ram according to your smartphone if you have have high end phone which have a lot of ram so you can use it the emo pc emulator going to use your android phone ram so now you, you have to enable mttcg and you have to uncheck disable tsc so this is the settings you have to do uh, many people commenting on my videos that they can't enable mtt cg so make sure you are using the latest version of the limbo pc emulator that i have provided the link in the description you can check out the number from there so we have done with the board now you have to get into the disk you have to select it disk a you have to click on the open now you have to select the windows 10 which i have provided the downloading you have to open as i mentioned earlier it will be a prox 5 gb so we have to select here now you can skip all the other parts like uh, removable drive uh, if you want to access you can if you want to access internal storage you can access from there if you want to know how you can do that let check out my previous video you have to click on the boot you can select the boot from hard disk so it will get to better detect it uh, in graphics you don't need to change anything if you want to get audio you can select the audio card if you want to uh, use internet you can select the network card at once you so here you can skip the part this video is only for quick review of the this windows 10 so that's why i'm skipping all the part if you want to uh, know how you can get internet let me know in the comments i make another video that this is going to work with the internet so we have done all the settings so let me just turn on the screen version and turn my android phone so you can get the better view for the better end understanding so let me just set up the camera and come back again so as you can see in the screen this is the limbo pc emulator i have done all the settings and i turn on the screen rotation while using windows i recommend you to turn the screen into landscape mode so you can get the better understanding and full screen uh, so let me just click to play button after clicking play, play button it will showing booting from hard disk so it's mean the vhd file is perfectly working and i'm going to boot if i get an error it means there are some problem in the vhd file or the windows file and as you can see it will saying booting from hard disk and the windows 10 has been started booting up here so let me just enable the status bar of the uh, limbo pc emulator so you can you can understand so as you can see this is the windows 10 logo so here it will going to take some time so let me just fast forward this video and come back after it's the windows 10 fully booted so as you can see in the screen the windows 10 has been successfully booted in my android phone and it will take in some few minutes to boot and as you can see this is the mouse cursor while using volume buttons you can uh, get the more option of the screen like mouse cursor the left click and right click with the same volume of button will be the left click and the one uh, down will be the right click of the mouse so as you can see
so as you can see just now if you click the volume down button and it will get the more option of the screen and this windows 10 is in the or russian language but if you want to change the language you can change into the english language if you want to know let me know in the comments i'm going to make a video for only members i've started uh, the membership on my youtube channel if you want to join you can join and if you want some highly demanded videos you can get um, only after you joining the membership so like this in this windows the language is in the russian but i can change into the english and i can show you how you can change so if you want to know that you have to join my membership of my youtube channel i'm going to upload that video on my youtube channel very soon for the members only so if you want to know you get you should get the membership of my youtube channel so now i'm going to check out the properties of the pc so let me just show you let me just click on the my computer and the volume down button as well right click and get me let me know the open the properties if you know how to use pc you can use it without changing the language like i am using and showing you so the this windows is very heavy for my smartphone i am using a mid-range smartphone uh, if you have a high-end smartphone you can use it too it will work very smoothly in your android phone it will be a prox 5 gb uh, more than comparing to real windows so as you can see in the screen this is the windows 10 2015 version and it's still loading about the details as i mentioned i have selected the sandy bridge Xeon e20 this is the processor 64 bit processor and 2 gb of ram 64 bit of windows 10 so as you can see this is the details it's in the literal language so just now I'll show you the properties of the pc so let me just click on the start button uh, there are not much uh, uh, preloaded softwares so this is the windows 10 so this is the fully working windows 10 running in android and as you can see this is the 64 bit version so i have not selected the uh, sound card and the internet card as you can see that's why it's not showing here not detected so if i selected the card it will going to work the internet but there is no browser in this windows 10 to use so if you want to know how you can install any browser or and how you can get the internet access let me know in the comments i i make a separate tutorial video for that so as you can see the windows uh, this video is taking very long time to so this video is very quick uh, overview of this windows 10 on how you can run windows 10 in the android this version so as you can see this is the fully working windows 10 running in android so that's it for this video thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel like this video share this video if you have any question or problem let me know in the comments thank you